Hi, uh, my name is Andrew. I'm attending the Pellegrino Almost Famous Chef cooking competition in New York City, and I'll be presenting a duo of pork with roasted pumpkin risotto, roasted Brussels sprouts, and baby pearl onions. Yeah, Chef Campbell and I uh, do get along really well together. I found out we share the same music taste in ACDC, which is kind of humorous. I feel like I can approach Chef Campbell very easily with questions. He approached me one day in the dining hall, actually, and said, would you be interested in, in a cooking competition? And I said, absolutely. I think it'll be a great experience, and we get along together, but he also will show me tips or tricks on how to correct myself and make myself better the next time, which is, I really feel like a professor and a chef should do. I knew that I was going to have to, to get a student who not only was skilled, but a student who was also going to be willing to put in the time. And I've always noticed that with Andrew, that he always tried to, to get better when he was in the classroom. He didn't just do his job and then wait for everyone else to catch up. He did his job and then he would seek out other things, other students and find out what they're doing whether he was helping them because he knew, already knew how to do it or whether he didn't know how to do it and he was trying to learn on his own. Um, and I also noticed that in his job choices over the last couple of years that he would always try to work on a weakness. A lot of people are kind of like golfers where they just want to go out and just drive all day and they never really want to work on the parts of their game that aren't good. Andrew seemed to want to work on his weaknesses and that was pretty impressive to me. Uh, the timing is very important to me. Uh, I really can't be too early or too late while plating and having everything presented. If I'm too early, uh, the judges kind of frown upon it and they kind of think, you know, why hasn't he done more? Why did he finish so early? And also, if I finish late, then all of the other contestants have to present their food and then I go after. So really, all of the food will kind of sit and get old and it won't be as presentable as the way I wanted it. Andrew has exactly two hours to prepare the food. He has to get 10 portions of the dish out in two hours. At the two hour point, he has a four minute and 59 second window to actually get the food served. So the food can be ready to go right at the two hour point or at the two hour point, he has to stop cooking and then has to plate everything up and again, get it into the server's hands by two hours, four minutes and 59 seconds exactly. I really do feel I'm ready for this competition. I've been practicing every day for the last two weeks. Chef Campbell and I have gone through everything with a fine tooth comb and kind of picked apart every single detail of every uh, part of the dish. If it's overcooked, if it's undercooked, if it's been seared too hot, if the rice was overcooked, all of it has gone into play and I feel I can nail this dish and I can do it in a timely manner and I can make it look beautiful. Those essential parts in my back pocket, so to speak, I do feel like I'm ready for this competition.